I'm back. I had to do something real quick. Okay. How to proceed? What to do? We have Dragon uh, Round Rage, so if we could get a vision from this guy, we could make them to make him burn. Seems doable. And after that, maybe Bruno can finish him off. Maybe uh, even Bruno can finish him off, like with the sauna. Yeah, I think I can. I can kill him with the sauna. I think I'll do that. Damn it! Not on my watch. Surprise, motherfucker! Wolf arrows it is. I'm not a young man anymore. So okay. Now we have this side cleared. Now we have to worry about this side. And uh we need to reload here. Rearming weapons. And systems. then we could go for this guy. And I think it might be a good idea. Because we have some blade storms after. Eight damage is pretty good. He's almost dead. We have ruined. We could stay in place to kill these lost and boss of the chrysalids. And I think I will. Uh, as for Zoe, I think I want to deal with these guys if possible. Drac, Drac can deal with them. Drac can deal with them for sure. Going turns, four turn go down. We might need it. Pressure blast the three turn go down. We do pressure blast. We missed one though. That's the one Zoe is going to go uh, after, or maybe even Dieter, we'll see. Dieter to see him from here. 82% is not bad. We're going to miss 25 damage, which means Amos is going to have to finish the job unfortunately. To have Doser in one action uh, with Trex, but Trex is going to stay in place. And uh, Zoe. If Zoe will finish that guy off, right? Finish that chrysalid off. Makes sense. Make sure that if the burning doesn't kill it, then. Easy. Yeah, this is happening right here. So no matter what he does, he's going to eat the blade storm. What is this guy doing? He's going to panic the dashers. Play storm. Really, you're able to do that without triggering Blade storm? Okay, fuck you. The Zephyr Mega still having fun with the lost. Bunching dead meat. This is like a party right here. Now that I have control of the rest of the enemies, I might just like throw a grenade there and see what happens. 
But we'll see, we still have this mutant to worry about, we have the purifier as well. This is a problem. Yes, just as I thought that I uh, got rid of the chrysalids, that thing is making more. That's annoying. Like, this is completely fucked up. Right as I thought, like, hey, uh, there's no chrysalids anymore. There's like only one chrysalid left, and then the one chrysalid goes there and starts uh, multiplying. So, chrysalids are so much fun. Heat thresholds approaching critical. Okay, then, uh, Zoe. We still have one grenade, but I kind of want to preserve that grenade for that pod with the armor preserver and the preserver Omega. So I kind of want to deal with these guys. If that's the case, I will lightning hands this guy, which is going to die. And then I'm going to fun fucking fire the fucking muton if I can. It's dead. Awesome. So now I will get closer with Zoe, but not too much. Next time we can grenade that fucking party happening over there. Uh, for now. Place right here. And uh, I'm not going to overwatch because. Well, we could overwatch actually. Yeah, I'll, I'll overwatch. Whatever. Now, you know what? I'm going to reload. And then uh, Bruno will just uh, consume. Dismissed. I'm going to get out. Through here. I'll try to access that building if possible with my grapple. If not, I'm going to reboot. Uh, no bueno. Can't do it. Not yet, at least. So, keep moving the old fashioned way. This is a reload into a movement. Uh, unless I would just dash. She's closer to the action. Rolling out. So yeah, next turn we're going to engage with the Omega. I want to kill it. If we're lucky, when we throw the grenade, we pull another lost uh, swarm right there, so it could help us. If we're lucky, we'll see. Okay, it's still alive though, which is good. Now the chrysalid. Lost swarm appears. Can a lost swarm appear there again? If it's not asking too much. Yes. Yes. Okay, the party continues. The party fucking continues. That's perfect. So all that's happening here is going to keep on happening. This is awesome. Okay, uh, okay, this is very neat time for Zoe. She might need to move a little bit, but I think uh, if she's here, it's uh, close enough. Yeah, you see? Yeah, this is happening. And I am going to try and get the other Berserkers as well, if possible. Yeah, I, I got... Uh, this one?
Zephyr Omega is going to get a reaction, but uh, she has so many enemies around her that we might be safe. And again, if we keep pulling uh, Lost Swarms there, it's going to be good for us. And she's even missing the, the Lost Dasher. It's perfect. Uh, okay, so if that's the case, and I kind of want to move tracks from here. I will keep him uh, here. And I uh, will keep him there for now. I'm going to... Probably I want to throw an acid grenade there if possible. That's what I'm going to try and do at least. If that's the case, maybe I want to freeze the Omega in, in place. So it... Uh... Was it Omega 92%? Let's go for the Frostbite here. Yep, it's frozen. That's fucking brilliant. And uh, now I'm going to go for... We lost Dasher, maybe? Not really. Yeah, but we, we don't have options, so might as well, right? Maybe the Chrysalid. Yeah, but it's a uh, cocoon, so it's useless. So. Let's kill that Lost, why not? Yeah, we'll just shoot at the Omega, why not? Enemy armor intact. So... Yeah, we should have thrown the acid grenade now in, in retrospect, so... Whatever. Again, if I call more loss, I couldn't care less. And I'm going to probably position myself. Grab some. Yeah, this position look, looks good. Knock me good vision. down and I'll keep getting back up. And uh I'm going to try and get vision of the Omega. See if I can do it. Uh, A2, we could kill the Berserker. I think I'm gonna go for it. One less Berserker to worry about. We even had the stock, so the kill was pretty much guaranteed. Uh, now we have Amuncia. Which, of course, I'm going to go for an area suppression there. I'm not going to, sh to hit the Omega with that, but... We could hit everything else. Or we could just uh, make the Omega burn. Which sounds like a good idea as well, it's already uh, acid burning. So burn plus acid burning. So acid burning. These guys are having fun with the loss too. Now there's a pool of acid here, which might discourage them from like circling around. But now we do have this chrysalid to worry about. These guys are still having fun. Lost might keep attacking them. But now that we are closer to this side, maybe we the, ne the the next Lost Swarm appears from the other side. So that could be a problem. Unless we keep someone like more to the to the other side so we can keep like forcing the Lost to come th from that direction. If that's a thing. 
Yeah, we have another uh, swarm. No, these ones were the ones from the previous swarm, yeah. My FPS is all over the place because a lot of enemies fire acid everywhere. My computer can't handle it! So how many turns until the Berserker Omega is back? Is it safe for me to attack her again now? Ends in one, any player turn starts. So I assume uh, she's going to get out uh, once we finish our turn. Okay, that's the thing. I kind of want to go for this one. Could happen. Dead. An eye for an eye. This is good, but it doesn't matter. We could kill the Omega now, but I kind of want to make sure. So. Let's see, I will, I will bring like Dither to this position. If we are not able to kill it, then we can disorient or stun with him. Uh, where's Drac? This is a pressure blast or, or a... Uh, I don't know, I don't remember the name of this skill. Fumigate? Fulmination? Explosive Chemtrol Blast. 2 to 5. And yeah, this one is better. Yeah, we'll go like this. Come on, Drac, anytime now. My god, the game is going to is going to stick in its sweet time. ourselves. I might have to reload this. Apparently the game couldn't handle so much stuff happening at the same time and uh, Drac using her skill. Or maybe not. Don't crash on me, just use the skill. <sighs> My god. What's happening? Okay, it took some time, but it went off. That's what matters, right? What's not so fun is that Berserker Omega like went uh, further away, so this is not very fun. But unless she used the fucking skill.
And now we have another freeze. Okay guys, we are back, uh, we are back in the same turn where the crash occurred, so yeah, the game crashed, um, and I had to like, um, turn it off, like, gave, I, like, I gave up on recording because it was too late, and because of my new, uh, routine, I, like, I have no time whatsoever, it was too late to keep on recording with that delay, so, uh, I'm recording this, the continuation of this mission, actually two days after my uh, attempt of recording that ended up in a crash. So this is the turn where Drag uh, used the pressure blast, but I think I don't want to push the Omega like I did, so uh, I'm going to take this opportunity of the crash and I'm going to using, uh, use Burn Rush. I'm going to Actually, I don't want to get too close. Maybe I do like here. Just for a good angle. And of course the game is like really laggy. Uh, the game is like the FPS is like all over the place because there's a lot of stuff going on. And it's going to get worse now because I'm going to try and burn these things. So it's going to add even more particles to the equation. So. Yeah, it's going to be a mess probably, but it's what we can do now. I'm actually going to burn like this probably. Uh, we'll see what happens. We'll apply, we'll apply the burning two times. I don't think I don't even know if I hit the Omega or not. Uh, she still has a 16, 25 HP. Let's see if this uh, will uh, deal any damage whatsoever. Did it deal any damage? We'll see. Okay, let's see, let's see. She still has 25 HP, but she uh, is completely surrounded in fire, which is good for us. She may attack the um, loss that are surrounding her. So, now, what do I want to do? I think I'm, I want to get close with Zoe for a caustic slot. Attempt to use a caustic slug on the Berserker Omega. It's an 88, 86. My recording overlay is like where uh, was like right on top of it. So 86% caustic slug. Let's do this. Okay, we did hit for 22 damage. Okay, she's still alive though. So. Have like any other area effect, or we could just uh, Reload. finish her off nice and easy. Rest in peace, Berserker Omega. You didn't have much of a chance on this fight, and we even got a hair trigger. <laughs> That's funny. And I just double clicked with my mouse, yeah. Let me tell her watch. 
we have we have one shot. Unless we go down. If we go down, we might have more shots. We have one more here. Honestly, I don't know if there's a uh, Berserkers left. I see one. I think both Berserkers are down. I see one Berserker here, one Berserker there, and I see the Berserker Omega Corpse as well. So we are fresh out of Berserkers to kill, so I think I might. You know what? I'm, I'm going to keep Bruno here for now. Just chilling. Uh, let the Lost make their move. We also have Bristolids spawning from that uh, uh, egg there, so there's also that. And I no think problem, I might area suppress this. She will only uh, take two shots. But I could, uh, who knows, maybe it gets something. And uh, as for Dieter, I could heal him. But I don't think that's necessary right now. Instead, I'm going to go for another Overwatch. Because these guys are gonna move for sure. So, let's let them move for now. Okay, we have an Armored Berserker as well. Okay. Okay. We do have a big target still. Good to know. We have another chrysalid, which I must is instantly reacting to, but missing. Lost Swarm appears. Where this time? Again, I don't necessarily care about killing more Lost. It's actually a good thing for us. We can easily kill them. It's one down, I think. Yeah. Another down. We have uh, two more bullets, I think. That's another last down. No, I think that that was all the ammunition we had. Okay. We have like what four dashers here, plus the normal ones. I must wait for second suppression, and that's a kill. We have to uh, expose the Omega somehow. So, if we want to expose the Omega, um, not the Omega, the Armor Berserker, I think the best way to do it would be to move a little bit and throw a rocket. So we can uh, shred any point of remaining armor it might have. No, it doesn't have armor, but maybe we could break the wall. I think she is beside the pillar or something. Like so? Oh, wait, 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 wait. It must highlight the fucking thing. You see? It's very finicky to highlight it in a way that it takes, it, it uses the wall, uh, it takes the wall as well. Very finicky targeting as always. Like this. It will have a reaction, but it has plenty of enemies to go. It's actually going for drag. You son of a bitch. You know what? Uh, why can't I? I don't see the Omega from here. But I could see from here. What drives a man to such madness? Okay. Uh, big shot. Get an aim penalty, but still, it's more than enough to hit the Omega, the 
armor berserker with 100%. So we'll do it. It's bleeding now. We already got its reaction uh, turn, so pretty safe. Uh, Zoe needs to reload. Dieter needs to reload. Amansa needs to reload. Two shots, maybe? No, I think I know a regular shot, right? Let's do this. We go for a regular shot, and we can always finish it off uh, in some other way. It's acid burning as well. We don't even need to to, uh, to shoot again. It's bleeding, and it's it has acid burning, so we don't need to do anything. It will just die by itself. So we can use this turn to get in, maybe get some lost kills here, some blade storm props from the prisons. I think all the lost here are, are dead actually. So we might just plant uh, tracks here and wait for those bladestone procs on the spawning chrysalids. Uh, do we have 92 here? Yeah, not that good. I think I'll just uh, take a more shot here. And then I'll wait for the Bladestone procs to happen. And uh, as for Zoe, could finish this off, but again, it's not needed. We might just go for the Dasher here. Never mind, we're gonna miss. Okay. Uh, so close. Guess I'm getting rusty. Uh, maybe. I don't care about the normal loss, I want the dashers, so let's go after the dashers. Headshot. Dasher. Headshot, nice job, Dieter. Nice job. Another dasher. Will you single-handedly take off Take out all the dashers that are threatening us. This one has a lot of HP. Never mind. We can do have the headshot card, so it's just uh Yeah. Armor Berserker is completely dead. Now let's get those juicy bladestone drops if these guys move close. Blade Storm proc before the attack ever happened, but it got the animation anyway. We have one more Dasher. And one more Dasher getting sliced by Trex. Okay, now we just need another Blade Storm. Yeah, I, <laughs> I, I was going to say now we just need to finish off the enemies we, that we have left. And uh, <laughs> perfect timing for uh, all we need was this another blade storm. <laughs> okay, that was funny. We need to reload here. Probably grapple somewhere where we do have like vision of the enemies. Mission ain't over yet. So we'll grapple here, reload, and try to take a few headshots with uh, Bruno. Knock me down, and I'll keep getting back up. So yep, yeah, it's lost killing time. Understood. Threat, unnecessary roughness, but I'll take it. You won't be forgotten. You're trying to impress me. We'll keep killing. They keep coming, and we'll keep killing. Tag them and back them. Old soldiers are hard to kill. It's time to, to reload again, fight. unfortunately. But uh, Dieter can always rush in and finish the job. 
once again to kill. Uh, we'll keep shooting. Uh, we could. Yeah, I'll just damage one of them and uh, be done with it. We got a head trigger as well. As soon as the game. Yeah, I, I was going to say. So let's try to uh, lower the HP for this one as well. We got the stop damage, which is uh, more than enough. So we'll see. Uh, good lightning! What? Good lightning hands one of them. Not the cocoons, the actual bristles. Then we are going to slash. And I just double clicked again. This is why we. Yes. This is why we slash the fucking cocoon there. God damn it, man. I have to. Get another mouse because this one is already annoying me to no end. Uh. Finish off this map. Whatever. Is it just me? Or is this too easy? Then we'll take a few shots against the Well not a few shots because yeah. I'm just going to position it here. And I'm going to heal drop. And just to, and just because we haven't used a uh, chain shot yet, if I can get vision of that cocoon there, some way somehow, which doesn't seem to be the case, yeah. So I'll just move in Overwatch. Whatever comes out of that, it's going to have a bad time against a blade storm and an Overwatch. Hopefully. No blade sword, no overwatch. Okay. One more turn to decide how we kill this thing. So... I don't know man, I think Trax can just uh, slash it and be done with it. This could be a kill. And it is. Okay, mission done. We We're out of here. Mission. mission accomplished. 105 enemies, so much of those, so many of those being lost corpses, that's amazing. It's all we needed to progress with our psionic research. Uh, Trex being the MVP, well done. I have like 15 kills here, 12 kills here, 11 kills here, 9 kills, 6 kills for Amos at this time. Okay. And now we're out of here. We're out of here. After two days of uh, idle time between the last time, between like the time where I started to record this, now two days after in the morning with my morning voice, uh, we are finishing this. So I'm gonna take this time to actually apologize for the all the time that is taken between episodes. I know it's been kind of rough to like uh, keep up with the interest, logging, RP uh, when the series takes so much time to get an episode out. I'm just going to say that I'm really sorry. Um, my schedule is like really tight right now. I'm working way more than uh, I was before, and uh, a lot of times I just don't have the energy. But show oh, I really apologize. I'm trying to find of a better ways to record and get these episodes out for you. Advent is eternal. They are not. And yeah, that's pretty much it. I'm gonna stop there to let the 
speaker do his thing, but that's pretty much it. Oh man. But now thinking in hindsight, uh, we were so goddamn lucky on this mission. Even with that early reveal, we were so goddamn lucky. Because the Omega like just stay there fighting with the lost. Uh, swarm and swarm and swarm and the Omega was just there oh, okay let me punch this loss let me punch this loss and uh, all we had to do was to take the slow approach kill everything else and then finally when we got the chance just focus fire on the Omega and she was down so I have yet that's amazing to discover exactly what type of exposure led to the creation of these lost civilians a bunch of promotions and yeah look at this one uh, I think she's a captain too two three yeah well, I think we have like three majors I don't I don't remember if uh, Drac is a captain as well so three majors we are on major territory which means that as soon as we get more supplies we can have another squad upgrade we'll have seven soldiers which is another uh, amazing power spike which comes in a very handy timing now that we are facing Omegas as well so we could get Ari Barrage which is amazing which is like ridiculously powerful uh, Traverse Fire which means we can shoot twice per turn yeah this is a really tough choice we might, we might uh, even end up taking both but for now, I think we we'll get Traverse Fire for now, but uh, we will get uh, Air Barrage eventually because it's too fucking powerful. There's no way. Um, then Trax, of course, being a major as well. We have uh, Face Off. Uh, Art of War, gain 3 aim for each enemy we can, you can see. This is really good. And uh, relocation, refunds one action point where you are revealed from consuming your own action. So we're not, we're not getting like the, we're not hitting like the stealth tree with tracks for now. We're focusing more on blades and pistols. So I think we might just take face off honestly. And uh, with Drac, yeah, she's on major too. Uh, Nightmare Fuel can throw our attacks on Chester Bell's Panic, which is pretty nice. Smells like Jin Spirit, Fumigate additionally removes Dazed and Serene Panic, Obsessed, Preserved, and Shatter, and Unconsciousness. Mana Spray against one additional charges. So, if we were going for the more um, supportive build with her, and uh, Oppressive Heat, Pressure Blast can throw Suppression and Overwatch is Orient Flow Foes. So Pressure Blast, Camp Thrower Suppression, and Overwatch. This is really good. Uh, an added effect to Pressure Blast. We use it a lot. Might take that. And uh, Dieter became a Captain now. Uh, medic Training. There's two extra uses for any medic kit. This is really good for the medic. Uh, Art Pole Servant, Zero Act Lord, Sinister Stun, Attack to Target any and Damage Mechanical Enemies, as well as reducing Defense Against Hacking Attempts. This could be useful. And I'll uh, put him down, we're going to plus 15 aim against our Zero Stun, just running to Daze or Panic. I think we're going to get more uh, med kits from Dieter. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. We got, we got a lot of shit from here. Uh, Intel. 56 corpses, this is amazing for our research. Uh, Banshee Corpse, Purse of the Reaper, Brute Mortar, Trooper Priest, Bolsters, Bio General, Bio Rocket Trooper, Purifier, Mutant Corpse, Berserker Corpse. Yeah, the Berserker Omega has like a normal Berserker Corpse for some reason, but yeah. Hello, Commander. And uh, we can also upgrade the bond between Zoe and Jock, which could happen. Let's visit the training center real quick. Actually, let me uh, visit the armory first. I think we have promotions here. 
uh, yes, we do have one from Bleeding XP. Now, uh, Ekon gets to be promoted to Corporal. Uh, Combat Fitness, plus 1 HP, plus 1 mobility, and 5 dodge. Raising fire is a chance to promote an additional role to become a grace. And a duelist, on your pistol shots to increase damage, pierce armor, and have increased uh, chance to hit. In addition, to you gain the return fire skill. That's really good. Um, I think. How much aim does he have? A 73 aim. We could go ahead raising fire with him. Additional roll to become a grace for missed shots. Uh, we could also just uh, use stocks with him, honestly. So. Why does the shots do increase it? Let's go. Let's actually go uh, this route with him. Uh, increased damage on the pistol shots, fierce armor, and have increased chance to hit. In addition, gain a return fire skill. This is actually uh, really strong. And uh, yeah, for now that's it. Emerald Lane. This is this is fun. This is fun. We'll see about that. So yeah, I can get promoted. And uh, training center. Let's. Uh, I think the ones that can use it more are Bruce and Joshua. And, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Six days. Let's go to the bridge. Take a look at the map again. It's been some time since the last time I looked at this juice game. Supply drop. Alloys and crystals. So what, what, what were we doing again? Were we making like contact or something? Yeah, we were making contact here, right? But we do need supplies. Do we have... Uh, yes, we do have. And uh, this is rapid collection, I think. Yes, this is rapid collection. But we do need supplies now. So we get supplies. Plotting new course. We need a bunch of supplies. Finally, we arrive upon the asylum of those depraved so... enough to defy the elders. Your friends would be wise to beg forgiveness with their final. Just as you're getting stronger, we are locating your stronghold. Are paying a heavy price with the chosen running loose. We should do what we can to take them down before Injury they warfare. hit again. We had some wounded soldiers requiring treatment after that last covert action. With a few days rest. They'll be ready to get back into it. BCS uh, effects are increased. Uh, now that we have majors, we can actually hunt the chosen. All three of them. This is amazing. All those freed from the elders' bonds are eager to hear your orders, Commander. Our influence with the resistance factions has motivated them to share some you know what? information on the chosen. It's time. It's fucking time. Uh, we'll send tra uh, tracks leading up, uh, leading this mission. Uh, then the soldier can be a normal soldier, right? So we'll send the assassin. Okay, we'll send Varus. Varus will be interesting going on this mission. Oh wait, no, we can uh, staff. Varus here. That's amazing. No. I'm adding the uh, Varus here. Okay. You know, we'll get another soldier here. Let's send... Well, Flynn is on uh, a... Oh, but I, I may need Flynn on the next mission because uh, Dieter is wounded as well. Then we'll get... Angie, Angie can go. Over from the action. Covert is our specialty. Infiltrate the stronghold so we can uh, attack the assassin whenever we have the chance. And uh, after we got supplies, we'll keep on making content. 
setting course for Sector 2, Australia. Workshop facilities, Commander. Workshop, no workshop has distance. been completed. Now we got the achievement for it. Okay. So, we'll stuff, stuff an engineer here. And uh, through that, I can. Oh, critical function that cannot be removed. Uh, we could upgrade this. 150 supplies. Yeah, we do have enough supplies to do it. Power relay upgraded. So we now have power. We could remove. Yes. Now we can staff a gremlin here. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. We have engineers uh, open now for all the good that that would do. And uh, I'm going to staff an engineer here as well. And uh, yep. Yeah. Oh yeah, now we have uh, Cyanix projects. So. Mount. I want all the mount. I want everything. Keep making contact. Venom rounds are ready. Uh, crystallized mount. Crystallized mount. Making contact. We're picking up Sending indications that the good. Elder's warlock actively working in this region. Okay, so now all we need to do is to build one tower, and we'll get the rapid collection. Not before getting another supply rate, it seems. Pathfinder search teams for more Pathfinder bodies. Uh, right control Mac Mark II. This is interesting. Chrysalid Quinn. Secured Beat and Dramadon, Elite Cryo Priest, Advanced Guard, and Sectoid Chrysalid Queen. Chrysalid Queen, my dudes. Chrysalid Queen. Holy shit. Okay. Yeah, we'll do this. Setting course for Sector 9. Western United States. But before doing this, we're going to actually visit the ship real quick, specifically the GDS. And squad size upgrade three. And now, my friends. Oh yeah, and we can also staff people here, but we'll wait after this mission because uh, we might need a few people here, from here, so we'll staff them later. So, where's the supply raid? Yeah, now we have seven soldiers, one in the back right there, so... In order to, yes, all we need to do is to roll the mall's wheel, right? Okay, like this, okay, I see, I see. Okay, so guys, uh, this episode has been too long already, and uh, it's already a two-parter, so I'm not going to build a team here. Uh, as I did before, I'm going to post the team that was selected to the mission um, on the on my discord server so if you haven't joined that please join uh, so this is going to be it for this episode one more time guys I'm sorry for the immense delay between episodes I am sorry also about the FPS situation that we got the crash that we got um, that delayed the episode like even further 
those are some technical limitations I am trying my best to work around. So yeah, this is it. I'm sorry for all the bad stuff that, that's been happening, but for all that's worth, uh, it's really good to be recording again. It's really good to be delivering an episode for you guys. So thank you so much for uh, bearing with me on this. So this is Commander Duma signing out. I'll see you guys next time. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to leave that comment in the comment section below. Smash the like button, subscribe to the channel if you haven't. Much love as always. Bye bye.